I want to touch on what you said, Mark, about creating an organic following as soul crushing, you know? And Ryan, I want to speak to you and get your opinion on it, you know? Because a lot of us are entrepreneurs and content creators at the same time. Because without creating content, you're non existent right now in social, in social media land. So, what can you say to people that are trying to build their following up in 2024, trying to get to that next stage of getting to that, um, you know, next stage of growing the following? Wow. Um, you know what? To be, I, and I could be very candid here because I feel like um, I definitely had time on my side. That's not taking away from any work that I put in. Uh, very different playing field when I started. I, I, I jokingly tell people when they're like, how, should I, like, how do I start an Instagram today? I'm like, don't. <laughs> because like, it's, uh, it's, not the same, it's not the same space every moment of this. Like, as that clock ticks, somebody else is jumping on. And not just a brand new person, people that already have multiple accounts, multiple presence, things are constantly changing. I think understanding um, why you're doing this uh, Mark touched on it earlier too, where people, I, like I get a million DMs saying, oh man, you must eat for free all the time. How do I do this? Like immediately, you know that person doesn't understand the landscape. Like I feed myself, I feed my family with this. This is not bit about getting burgers and fries, right? So I think really kind of understanding the field that you're going to enter into um, from a very, very like well-rounded um, perspective is huge. Yeah, like, yo, you're hearing from the master. Like, I got 3,000 followers, okay? So, um, you know, it, it kind of hit me like a rock when I realized that right now, um, I started driving race cars. And part of driving race cars is getting sponsorship. And the thing that I bring to the table that other drivers don't is that I have a business background. So I can come in and understand the needs of the business and say, hey, listen, how can we drive revenue for you? And um, we would get all the way there. That would always open doors for me. Like that was a really great way to open doors. I could open doors that other people couldn't. But when it came down to close a deal, the next thing they ask is, well, what's your social media following? So I used to kick and scream and be like, you got to be kidding me. Like I don't want 100 million people who don't know who I am that, po that like my stuff. But what I can tell you is I know, uh, you know, 100 of the most influential people in Canada that I'll pick up the phone when I call. So let's make a deal. And they didn't care. So with where I'm at right now in my life, not having a social media presence is actually taking away from my opportunities. I'm not doing it the other way around where I think that I have nothing to offer and I should start a social media account because then people will want me. It's the other way around. I'm just losing from everything I've learned, everything I've done, everything I've accrued in my life from the network to the resources is actually being stifled by not having a social following. So that's my problem. So I decided this past year that I need to double down on my content creation. Now what I want to tell all of you, and just to give you guys a little bit of hope at least in case your social game isn't popping, I always say I'm a young black founder who sold his company for 16.7 million bucks. I have a book deal with Forbes. I travel the world with my wife. I drive race cars and I run marathons. And I have 3,000 followers, okay? So trust me when I say it is difficult to break <laughs> into this, all right? So the reason I say that is that now what we decided to do was that we we're posting three pieces of content per day per platform across the board. And I'm investing heavily in that. You know what my average view is right now? 2,000. Okay? So I like to think my content's okay. I think there's value in it. It's really a lot of short form podcast clips like this or me talking about business advice. So the reason I'm saying this, because when you know we're hearing the idea that social media is becoming harder and harder and harder, just think about that. That's like the level of that where it's at. So what I want to do is make a post at some point when I get my first one that goes viral. And I want to show people, here's how much money I spent. Here's how many pieces of content I posted just to get one post to go viral. So where I'm going with this is that there are way better, more talented people in the social game who understand the algorithm. They're going to build content and they're going to build an audience that has the ability to grow faster than your own personal brand. Because I think, and I could be wrong here, but I think the faster way to do build social media is not necessarily to build your brand, it's to find a niche that's really hot right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. Right, yeah, so the idea, I guess, is if you wanna build a social media following just from, uh, uh, just for the sake of having a big page, you're probably gonna wanna choose a niche, double down on that niche with content for that niche. That's the way you can really get it going. It's difficult when it's a personal brand. Um, but the reason I just, I wanna share this with people is just to show, because I feel I hear kids all the time, they post twice a week and like, ah, oh, like I'm, I suck, because they haven't blown up yet. And I just wanna show to be like, listen, like 
if I'm struggling, of course you guys are going to struggle. Like, of course this is a difficult thing. Don't feel bad about it. Just find the way to make it happen. So that's like my thing with organic content right now. Um, and I don't necessarily know where it's going. Like, I don't know if it's going to continue with short form being king or is it going back to long form or what's the, what's the game. But it's a serious game for sure.